Welcome to watch this video of a demo gate made by Dalian Good Display. This is aimed to help the users to learn how to drive e-papers quicker and easier. It's designed for 3.5, 4.3, 6, and 8-inch e-papers. Driver codes of four sizes displays are integrated in the demo by using dialers to switch. Now, we will take 3.5-inch e-paper as example to show you how to do image updating with integrated code and how to change the display image by compiling to demo board. First, connecting this e-paper to the board is 3.5-inch. And second, uh, connecting the simulator to the particularly left 20 pins port. And third, power up the board with 5 volt power adapter not using the USB cable because sometimes current output is not enough for the whole circuit. And the important thing is that making sure the dialer 2 is positioned on. Now, you can turn on the switch and find that image start flicking. If not, then you have to check again if dialer 2 is positioned on and if bottom light indicate e-paper working status is on and if right light indicated power input is on. Now move on to the PC. You got to have these three things for set up your developing environment. Photoshop, image converter and Q5 for C compile. First, we need to prepare a suitable image. Open Photoshop. Create a new file and change the resolution to the same as a papers. For 3.5 inch, it is 800 plus 480. Choose your preferred way to draw your image, and you finally will need a monocolor image file. So give up all colors in the end and save it as BMP format. Then open Image 2 LCD, which will be provided to you along with your demo kit order, although it's in Chinese but simple to use. But you also need to know that there are so many other tools you could manipulate the pictures, or write your own program to batch processing. Press Open. Ahead to find the picture you made just now, and start setting. Choose Save Code Data, Vertical Scanning, Full grayscale and set max length and height according to resolution. And check box of MSB first. And after all this, do not forget to press this right arrow to save the setting. After saving, there will be a notification on bottom bar showing image output is same as resolution. And choose color reversal and save the output code to a C text file. Finally, come to queue. Follow my site and set up your queue environment. First, an important part is let the queue recognize our simulator. Click Set and add our MCU inbox. If you're not quite understanding of this part, just follow our site to have a whole check of the settings. And making sure you choose the right chilling debugger and add settings to set inside. Then find the main function in this project and ahead to definition of EPT display pick. Now we only need to replace this default array to the new picture one. Open the C text file generated just now. Click at beginning and shift it to the end of this array. Grab copy and paste it in queue. 
and remind this every time when we made any change. Compile it. See the console window is showing the status log. And finally, done without an error and warning. Check again. Everything is plugged in board and turn on both demo and simulator. Then click Run. Start code execution. It's done. Hope you fully understand all procedures. And any question, contact our sales. Enjoy your project and welcome to visit our official website, www.gold-display.com. See you next time and thanks for your time.